What's going on everybody? Welcome back. Today I'm going to take a more in-depth look at some of the Badlands gear that I use on a season by season basis. Um, I did a brief overview a couple videos ago about everything that I take, whether I'm going on a, a you know, a long public land full day excursion, you know, an evening hunt on the property or over the plot, or even some of the stuff is compatible for, you know, those longer three, four, five day mountain hunts out west. I want to start this off by saying I am in no way affiliated with Badlands at all or any of the products that I, I talk about and use. I use them because I believe in them. They're proven, they're tested. I've actually used all of this gear multiple times and in, am no way disappointed in any of it. They're not paying me to say this. I truly stand behind these products. The big guy, the Badlands, Vario 65. It's 6,500 cubic liters. It's a, it's a multi-day pack. And it connects to the Vario frame. Just some more details. It's got a double drawstring. Top. This drawstring closes. This drawstring closes. The hood folds over. Clips down. Now you have an extremely water resistant pack. No water is going to get into the top. All your gear inside is going to stay dry, safe, your electronics. Everything inside is going to stay really, really dry. It's not 100% waterproof. They don't advertise it as 100% waterproof. It's highly water resistant. They do, and I'll get into this in a little bit, they do offer 100% waterproof cover that goes over top of it. Um, some of the other things, it's got big side stretch pockets. Okay, you can put your, your Nalgene bottle in there. One of the things that, you know, I use it for sometimes, put the spotter in there. And of course, it's got all the straps, to strap everything down, make sure everything's safe and secure. Inside, it's compatible with their their bladder so it's got a it's got a bladder spot as well as all the necessary components to run your bladder hose up and through the top of the pack like you're supposed to you can see in the pack it's extremely big you know I could put my whole arm in it and then some it's got a side pouch for easy access while it's connected to the frame. If you don't want to open it all up, you can access the side of it, easily get in there and get whatever you need. Whatever equipment that you need, you can get it out of the pack in an extremely timely manner. Continuing on got the vario frame this is the back of it this is the large meat shelf all the clips on the pack very secure this is the meat shelf the vario game bag attaches right to the pack pack out all your meat it weighs in at just under eight pounds it's got load lifting straps. Make sure you can get the support you need packing out those heavy things or packing in your camp. The side pockets, extremely convenient. Put all your stuff in there. If you're a rifle hunter, put some extra ammo in here. Right now I got my wind checker in there. It's got two on both sides. Now the pack comes with what they call the Batwing. I have the Deluxe Batwing attached. 
It's just another strap system that straps across the pack, but offers two big pockets on both sides. Once again, another good place. Put your spotter, easy in and out access on the go. Spotter goes in there, nice and secure. Now that's the frame. I'll get some close-ups here, and then I'll show you how it attaches. All right, now let's get this thing connected. It's really simple. They made it foolproof almost. It does look intimidating because of all the buckles, because of all the straps, but ultimately it's a three and four step process. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is take the bag and set it on top of the frame like so. You can see when I turn it around here, two connectors come in and it sits on top of the frame like so. This the hood comes in and goes over top of this, hiding the connection points. Okay, you're gonna flip it over, you're gonna lay it down. You're gonna take these long bedroll straps right here and put them where they go, through the slot, like so, simple. Now you're able to adjust it. Do the other side. Like so. Then you're going to come in here and on the frame, there's these red straps. They made it pretty easy. Red goes to red. On the pack, there's a red hook, come in, hook it up, close it up, like so, you get a close up, zoom in, red to red. Now you're going to do the same thing over on the other side. Red strap, adjust it. Loosen it up to where you can get it in there. Connect it to the pack, like so. And then that's it. You're done. Simple. Connect and pack, the frame, in under three minutes. Now that the pack is on the frame, this is the bat wing, like I discussed before big pocket with straps that come across to the front of the pack like so clip from one side to the other that way you're able to take your bow your rifle, whatever you're taking with you, and strap it right down into the middle of the pack. Easy access, in and out, clips off. Nice and quick. One of the other great components about these pack systems, the very ones particularly, they all have this dropout rifle bow boot. And it drops out. You're able to take, put the butt of your rifle in here, and with the bat wing, once again, strap it across the front of the pack and be on your way. It's also got a big hood storage pocket in the hood. You're able to get in there, keep my rain gear right in the hood, quick, easy access, don't have to go through a bunch of pockets. Once again, 
Badlands products. Okay, on to the next. This is the Vario Day Pack. 2,200 cubic liters. Hydration compatible. Storage in the front, two storage pockets, as well as, again, big stretch side pockets. This pack connects to the Vario frame, but also doubles as a regular day pack. Put the straps right on like a regular backpack and just take this or if you're feeling froggy, you can hook it up to the frame. Same way you would hook up the big pack to the frame and off you go. It's also got a big pouch here in case you need to store some ballistic information, piece of paper, your tags, your license can go in there. It's going to operate right on your chest. Keep everything nice and safe right in front. Once again, easy drop out, pull the binos out, good to go. Now it comes with a regular harness. And I use the regular harness sometimes. But one of the great things that Badlands has done is they've made a bino connect system. And what I can do with this Bino Connect system, and I'll show you how it operates right now. Everything I need comes in this little pouch right here, like so. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take it on the bottom. It's got a dropout rangefinder shelf. It's adjustable. You can move it up and you can move it down depending on the size size of your rangefinder. Once again, got a tether to keep it connected. That way it doesn't fall out if you're not paying attention. Magnetic release, extremely quiet. Two big side pouches. Like you see, keep my wind detection in there. And one of the great features about this is because it's an optics case, gotta keep your optics dry. It's got a pull out rain cover. Just goes on here like this. Like so. And just like that, your bino harness is now 100% waterproof done raining pop it out fold it back up goes in the big pouch in the back zips it back up and I'm gonna connect the bino harness using the bino connect molly points right to the front of the pack So to connect the vinyl harness, all you do, take the straps out, put the straps in the buckle, here on the strap, on the frame, it's marked, it's labeled, you just take this vinyl harness clip, this is what it looks like, and it just slides down into this. here now it's connected you adjust it to what you need it to be and it's actually easier if you put it on to do it 
if I have my bino quick connect straps here I'm gonna come over here I'm gonna take my harness I'm gonna clip it here I'm gonna clip it here I'm gonna adjust it to where I want it and now these clips I'm gonna come here put my chest strap across now my bino harness is here and this these connect over here on the side like so Adjust it again, adjust it again, make everything tight. Now, vinyl harness connected right to the frame. One set of straps over your shoulder, not two. So, once again, as you can see, vinyl harness attaches right to the pack frame. It also will attach right to the straps on the day pack and give you the same same look same concept one set of straps over your shoulders not two next up is the badlands frame protector now this fits on the vario frame So, pull it out, got the top and the bottom. This is on the top, it goes through the hook, like so, like this, strap it in. Similar to the rain protector on the vinyl harness. Just stretch it over, top of the pack like so now ensuring that a highly water resistant pack is now 100 percent waterproof and i have actually gotten caught in a rainstorm and this was a lifesaver when i got back to my vehicle i was able to dig through the pack get warm dry clothes and they were dry everything else was soaked everything in the pack was dry if you're gonna get a Badlands pack and you're not gonna get anything else that they have other than the frame in the pack, I would get this. This is a lifesaver. Like I said, getting back to your vehicle, trying to change clothes and having things be damp and you know, holding moisture inside the pack is, it, 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 it's never funny. Moving on. We have a Vario game bag. Now this game bag attaches to the frame the same way your pack attaches. Big, put a whole elk quarter in there if you needed to. Two white tail quarters. It's washable, it's reusable. And it attaches, like I said, right on the frame, same way that the pack attaches. And it also has all these Molly attachments on it. So when you're packing things out, you got your last two quarters, your last quarter, you want to strap, you want to strap the cape and the skull to the game bag and pack it all out at once. You could do that. last on the list from badlands are their everything pouches these pouches are actually in the approach fx camo everything else 
is in approach camo. These are great, they're waterproof. This one I have set up for, you know, potential bad situation, fire starter, extra flashlight, compass. Flint and steel is in there, in case I ever need it. Got these great attachment points, attaches right on to a lot of different things. You can attach it right to your hip, on your belt, if you needed to. These are great. I use them for a bunch of different things. They have these points, you can take your carabiner, hook your carabiner to it, hook it to many of the different attachment points on the pack. I have one that I set up that I use when I go muzzleloader hunting, put my powder, my caps, my wads, everything in here, keeps it nice and dry, which is important. All right, the last thing, just gonna show you how easy it is to pack your rifle. This is not my rifle, this is a, this is a pellet gun, just using it for an example. I do squirrel hunt with this. It is extremely effective at putting squirrel gravy on the stove. But this is the dropout weapon boot. You can take it, put your butt of your rifle in there, flip it over, strap it in, down there, get that tight, like so. And then if you're gonna add anything on the side, on the bat wing, once again, just an example, I usually don't keep this in the scabbard while I have it connected to the pack, but I will take it, I'll put it here, stretch my bat wings over, tighten my bat wings down, strap my bat wings like so. Get everything nice and tight. Obviously it's not tight right now. But you're able to use both of the bat wings like this. Your rifle, your bow is secure on your pack, on your back for those long trips into your hunting area. So that's it. Thanks for watching. This was the Badlands deep dive. Like I said in the beginning of the video, Everything that you see here, I use season after season, and I have no complaints about anything. Badlands, they're great products. One of the best things that I've failed to mention, they have an unconditional lifetime warranty on all of their products. It doesn't matter if you're on a hunt and your campfire gets out of control and your pack goes up in flames, Badlands replace it. It doesn't matter if it's in your car, your truck, it gets stolen, Badlands replaces it. Grizzly bear comes into, comes into camp while you're out hunting, rips open your pack, eats all your mountain house. They don't replace the mountain house, they replace the pack, Badlands. Great products, great stuff. Thanks for watching. If you like what you see, subscribe, hit the bell. There's plenty more to come.